this is for the Con Conservation Land Acquisition Fund. It's the Conservation Land Fund. Is it, is it underwater or what? <laughs> Some of it is. All right. What under up? the land. <laughs> Only at low tide. All right. Kick over here. All right. Um, sure. I'll read this one. Shall the town of Hampton vote to raise and appropriate the sum of $20,000 to be placed in the Hampton Conservation Commission land acquisition fund? That's why I'm saying acquisition fund because that's, that's what, what how it's written. And I believe the conservation coordinator um, notified that that word should have been taken out of the warrant article. Is that, was it? I, I believe that was the case. You need to take more than one word out. You need to take out land acquisition. All right, keep um, reading. We're going to only get a vote on what's in front All right, of us. While they're discussing, okay. I'm going to keep reading. This sure. fund is used to acquire, maintain, improve, protect, or limit the future use of or otherwise conserve and properly utilize open spaces and conservation easements in Hampton in accordance with RSA 36-A colon sections 1 through 4 inclusive. Recent acquisitions such as Batchelder Field Conservation Easement have significantly reduced the size of the fund. The goal is to return the fund to adequate levels to enable the, com the, com the Commission <coughs> to conserve additional lands on behalf of the Town of Hampton. So this money is just to enhance the fund. All right, I shall move that as, re as you read it. Okay. Stephen, second. second. Okay, second by Scott. Anything you want to add to that? Um, I'll be happy to answer your questions. Um, I think the article is pretty straightforward, and it's as it has been in past years. The money is to be used only for the purposes stated um, as per RSA 36A. Okay, there's a lot of purposes though in there, and I'm going back to the title on this Conservation Land Acquisition Fund. What is the, this article called? The intent is for it to be the Conservation Land Fund, and the reason for that is rather than land acquisition, is because the purpose, as stated in the RSA, that these funds can be used for is more than just acquisition, it's for maintenance, preservation, um, uh, to maintain, to acquire, maintain, improve, and protect open spaces. So it goes to more than just acquisition. Naming the fund acquisition, as, as we've said in prior years, creates confusion. It had been called the Land Conservation Fund earlier on. Um, I'm sorry, the Conservation Land Fund in warrant articles in 2002. Let me back up. It sure. was called the Conservation Land Fund? Let me give you briefly history. Um, in 1987, warrant article 32 passed and amended appropriated $75,000 to what at that point was called the Conservation Commission Accumulation Fund. <laughs> okay, wait a minute. In 19 what? 87. That's a different fund. The purpose was stated, and that was. I'm. I'm sorry, Jade. I. I, sure. need, I, I really need the details on this, so that's why. I sure. Wanted warrant we, article we thirty-two. So long. In not 1987. A, it was what? In 1987. Conservation was, commission. What was it called then? The Conservation Commission Accumulation <coughs> Fund. The stated purpose for that fund was not worded identically, but but in spirit this purpose of that fund is the same as what we're calling the conservation land fund but it didn't s specify the way it's written now and where would I find the way this one is written or is that just a copy of the statutes the way the one in 1987 was yeah uh, I'm sorry I don't have that with me, but it is in the annual report. It's in the annual report, 1987. Um, wait a sec, wait a sec, wait a sec. Um, I'm sorry, I do have it. On petition of Peter E. Tilton Jr. and 10 more legal voters to see if the town will vote to raise and appropriate the sum of, 
what the original request was for thirty thousand dollars it was amended up to and approved to seventy five thousand dollars to raise and appropriate the sum of thirty thousand dollars for the conservation commission accumulation fund fund said sum to be applied to the protection of undeveloped lands in hampton and the management of said lands for the public good per recommendation of the conservation land bank committee which i had never heard of before i don't know who that is or what that was a petition um yes thanks so, you know when last we met we were asking how many different funds there were and what their names were and it really sent us on quite a journey we're just trying to get this all straight tonight on what they're called where they are how many there are there is i think i can answer that for you okay um there is one if you will fund and you can liken it to the town's general fund and there are line items under that um we have <coughs> under that fund we have the salt marsh fund if you will an allocation for salt marsh and an allocation for island path those are called out separately because those were specific donations from private entity that were to be used for a specific purpose. Was that a power They haven't been thing? used for that purpose, which is why those funds have been retained in the account. Okay, and those funds, are those the ones that are held in a money market? Um, I believe so, by the treasurer. Because we have one money market held by the treasurer under the Hampton Conservation Commission? Does that <coughs> ring a bell on those two? Um, I don't know exactly where she's got each of these pools of money, if you will. Yeah, there was a, uh, in those papers from the treasurer, there's one that gives that salt marsh fund, whatever it's called, it's listed. Yeah. Okay. It's like there are, there no, are no, we're trying, to, they're not, they're trying to just see how many different funds we have, how many right. different descriptions we have within these funds because we're looking at a Warren article that we don't that we don't have anything named for that right all right so <coughs> if we're raising money it needs to go to a specific place and we need to know where it's going and as we started and left off with the last meeting with you just trying to determine and, and these are documents sent to us by the treasurer by the way um, okay and we are showing a, a Hampton Conservation Commission um, money market account we are seeing requests by the Hampton Conservation Commission um, and on that there is the operating account the conservation land the salt marsh and island path correct so there's four different entities under that and you're saying that um, the salt marsh and island path were from monies that were given in the past monies that were donated to the Conservation Commission for those specific projects. Those specific projects. So only things done in the salt marsh or in Island Path can be taken out of that account? Yeah, well, the salt marsh is a name that was given to a project um, that was going to be an educational site off um, Island Path. I'm sorry, off of Huckleberry. Salt marsh restoration that was going to be off Huckleberry. It was going to involve the installation of a culvert un under Huckleberry Road. The reason that didn't go forward is because one of the property owners there um, uh, objected to the project, and it and it hasn't gone forward. Okay, so, so so those monies were allocated specifically to that project. The Island Path project was an educational site that was going to be developed off of Island Path. Subsequently, we learned that there was a waste site, uh, town waste uh, dump site there, that prevented us from going forward with that project. Well, let me ask a question about okay. that while you're there. If you can't continue with the project and somebody donates money for a particular thing to be done, and you can't do it, don't you return the money? Um, in this particular case, um, this past year, actually, we got permission from the donator to reallocate those funds. Oh, that's okay. Yeah. Okay. <coughs> give it back. 
So yeah. there is something going on at Salt Marsh because I see an expenditure right, see back in the November report for $6,150 on that. The treasurer is still keeping those funds under or those monies under those names. However, they are being reallocated to the Ice Pond Dam project with permission from the grantor, from the donator. And what fund will that sit in when it's reallocated? It's going to remain in <coughs> <coughs> under the name Salt Marsh and under the names Island Path until those <coughs> funds are expended. So it's, it's not going to be renamed. I hope you can understand our confusion. Yes, there's, I can. There's the expenses don't line up with any of the things that the there's no name coordination here. We can't fall. It's a maze. Um, so Salt Marsh is now Ice Pond. If you will, Salt Marsh is now Ice Pond, and so Island what is Path, Island Path? What is, is also Ice Pond. Oh, okay. They're well, both may Ice Pond. Out, may I point out, Madam Chair, just for clarification? Yep. We're talking either funds or accounts. They're two separate animals. The, the names that you're rattling off are the names of accounts. It's clearly spelled out on their, right. on their account. sheet, the manager's so account. Control sheet. Mm -hmm. Operating account, conservation land account, Salt Marsh account, Island Path account. Right. They all, those accounts live under a fund called the Conservation Fund. So the they're all is, under the conservation fund. Then what is under the town budget? The town budget expenses are, are not controlled by the treasurer. They're under the finance director. So all of our expenses that are under the town budget go to the finance director. And those are um, salary of our conservation coordinator, um, the expenses covering our recording secretary, our um, <laughs> our office expenses, um, office supplies, mileage, seminars, um, other fees that we incur. I have another question while we're here. Now, on this Warnock, what you call it called the Conservation Land Acquisition Fund. We can't come across one of those. There is no fund with that label. So it's an account. So my suggestion would be for somebody uh, to change it to what the fund is actually called, as you suggested, Madam Chairman, and have us reconsider it when it gets changed in the war article. Because we can't, I don't see how we can justify voting for, to go to a fund when the fund doesn't exist. That's like saying, why don't we give the mon money to Mike Pierce's fund? I love the idea, but it doesn't exist. So why don't you give us a, a change the label to something that works legally? I'm confused. What? So conservation land acquisition fund, that's actually going to go into the conservation land account? Correct. Well, I mean, the, the voters are being told it's going into a fund that doesn't exist. Doesn't exist. Apparently the operation. Well, why not just take that word out, acquisition and conservation And the land, land. too. Right. right. And then it would. Right. I well, mean, that's there, what are, we're there, asking. Are, there are some <laughs> ways of, of curing this problem. But we uh, are not in power. We can't to change it. We can't change it. Well, if I'm not mistaken, he did lead off with the fact that there was a request made. It just hasn't been adhered this yet. Yeah. So I think. So I think the only thing we can do is table this until we get a warrant article that is uh, representative right. of that. So what's All the right, plan I like at this point? Change it to what? I'll I'll withdraw my motion to. And I'll. Needs to be straightened out. Okay. So, uh, uh, wait, do you have any idea what they're going to change it to? And take out land and acquisition. It's a conservation fund. Okay. Well, I would suggest that since the motion maker removes his motion, that uh, we simply communicate to the board of selectmen that we see this warrant article as flawed in that the land acquisition well, fund does not apparently I don't know. exist. I don't know that we have to And allow them to do whatever me. they think is appropriate. I don't know that we have to communicate to the Board of Selectmen as much as we need to. This is an independent Jay. commission. He's writing mm -hmm. this Warren article, correct, Jack? Correct. No, oh, okay. no, no, this is a Board of Selectmen Warren article. Is this your Warren article or Board of Selectmen? Well, it's not a petition warrant article. It's a town warrant article. It's a town warrant. Oh, okay, then I, I stand corrected. Yeah. Okay, then I would say that mine's got to get together because we need the name of the fund that it's going into that actually has a real place. The land acquisition fund does not appear to exist. Um, so we need to be able to see that wording tied with the money and where it's actually going. Seems simple. Hmm? Seems like a simple... Uh, yeah. You want us simple. to table it then? 
It's, I mean, it's, that was the motion I was going yeah, to make, is that and, somehow we communicate. To and that would give the opportunity for the wording to be corrected to reflect the fund that it's going into, and we can actually tonight. vote on it next Wednesday. Okay. Right. okay. Make the motion. As enough? long as I'm here, Wait. do you have any other questions about the warrant article itself? No, we're I just... Understand, I understand your issues. Okay. With the, with the I, think, I think enough said. He understands what the issue right. is. The article, the, the article should change to... So the people recognize we're changing the name of the fund. No, we're simply communicating no. to the Board of Selectmen that the land acquisition fund doesn't appear to exist. Yes. Thus, we see this Correct. Warren article as flawed. Yes. Okay. Yes. If the Warren article comes back to us in a different way, or even if it comes back to us at all, we will vote on it on Wednesday. That's the motion I put out there at the table. I'll this until that. Wednesday, the Board of Selectmen have a chance to take whatever curative action they see appropriate. Fine. With our advice that it appears, based on our research with the treasurer, right. that the conservation land acquisition fund doesn't actually exist, right? Except as an account. I'm assuming that this will actually be part of the conservation commission fund, right? Mm -hmm. Conservation right. fund, yes. Yes, yeah, conservation it. fund. You, you want conservation fund. All right. You no, second it. I All second in favor it. of tabling it to oh, Wednesday. All in favor of tabling. Table, Hello, table, 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 table. Mike, what's the matter? Unanimous. Thank you very Thanks. much. Thank you, Jay. 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 Thank you, Jay.